What is up guys, welcome back to a brand new video of Pokemon Goes and today I'm going to be talking about a little bit of news and a little bit of something that's happened this week that I thought I'd briefly just brisk on and talk about as well. So, as you guys know, the servers did get hacked this week or DDoSed in a sense. Uh, they got taken offline for a long period of time, but I believe it was a day, I'm not entirely too sure. We had no idea who actually took them down, no one actually claimed responsibility. And then Poodle Corp, which is a sort of a big hacking sort of group at the moment, they've taken down a lot of big YouTube accounts. If you type them in on Google, I'm pretty sure you'll find loads of information about them. But apparently on July the 16th, 2016, they put out this tweet saying, Pokemon Go, hashtag offline, hashtag Poodle Corp. And that was at 1.54 p.m. Now, no one is sure that they actually did take this oh, the Pokemon Go servers down, um, but they are claiming that it is that. Then after, shortly after, Anonymous replied by saying this tweet, the servers are down because of a worldwide outroll of the application. Simply too many people are playing, which is very true. If you think about it, you know, you have an app that wasn't even released in certain countries and people were still playing it, like myself in the UK and loads of other different people. And then when it finally hit the app stores for iOS and sort of Android and all your iPhone users and everyone else, basically everyone just sort of flooded it. And, you know, we all can't play on the servers i don't think they anticipated this many people playing i even know people's mums that are playing this game which is absolutely insane so yeah they were offline worldwide and obviously we were all up in arms uk and dutch and american players were all offline as well furious because the troubled app would not work but that is entirely fine obviously we are going to have issues throughout that because we are literally flooding the servers i don't think they did get hacked let's be honest but poodle corp they are a very big hacking organization and we know this because we can see it through all the social media i'm not just talking about youtube but many different other things they are renowned for doing big things like this and i'm not surprised if they did or they didn't but still i'm not entirely too sure guys let me know what you think in the comment section i really would like to know but i would agree strongly personally with uh, anonymous i just think there's too many people just trying to flood gate too many people trying to get on and uh, that's my opinion of that but a lot of people were pissed off on that day including myself not too sure not gonna point fingers but that's literally just my thought as well too many people playing it but if anything crops up or develops within this i will let you guys know and uh, yeah i'll keep you posted on the matter and that's all we got time for on this video. If you did enjoy this video, make sure to give me a like. Let me know what you think of this subject as well. Leave it down in the comment section below. And obviously subscribe for more Pokemon Go daily videos. We're going to be covering news, hints, tips, rumors. And obviously I'm going to be doing my vlogs. If you haven't checked those out, obviously there are a few links and annotations probably on the screen or down in the description. Make sure to go and click one of those. But until the next Pokemon video, guys, Kelly Kev here and Kelly Kev out.